my name is Warner Workman. Hey, I'm up here at Men and Men Arms. Listen, I'm going to do something now. Never done ever. I'm actually going to have this quote unquote sale, right? So I am the nation's smallest gun store, the nation's largest online inventory, right? And I pride myself in being a non stocking dealer. In other words, I don't want people breaking in, stealing stuff. Martin's Bird the other day, 40 guns were stolen from a gun store uh, that was broken into, right? So I just have a different business model. But as it turns out, I actually ended up collecting a few firearms. Uh, over the past year, and I want to get rid of them. So this is not a quote unquote, I'm not jumping on the bandwagon for a Black Friday uh, sale. But I'm going to, I got uh, 12 firearms that I'm going to discount heavily, right? And my goal is to sell them today so I can transfer them over to you tomorrow. They're in stock right now, and I'm going to show them to you. So bear with me, right? Uh, incredible deals on these, right? And, and a lot of them, if not all of them, I'm actually probably selling below my cost. At a minimum, I'm selling them at my cost, some of them below that, right? Okay, so let's go. Uh, so I got a bunch of handguns. I got, uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six handguns, six long armed, right? So, so bear with me. Uh, I have a Walther PK380. Now, what happened was, is uh, I had a good customer of mine. So I normally don't take back firearms. I had a good customer come in. Uh, he bought the thing, got it, didn't like it. And so I took it back, right? Because, you know, I want to make the guy happy, right? So here's the deal. So typically, uh, so the MSRP, nobody pays that, right? Nobody pays. So I'm just going to mention this one time is 470 uh, I typically sell it for 427 But right now, the second, I'm going to sell it for 375 Can you see it? 375. Uh, it's got a full size grip. It's compact, uh, but it's a 380. I actually like those little PKs. They're actually pretty neat, right? Uh, bottom line, 375 on my website. So go to my website, and what, so I'm going to look down at my little TV screen every once in a while. So you go to my website. If you look on the left hand corner, you'll see in store, in stock, which means I have it in the store and in stock, right? Uh, and if you look under firearms, you're going to see this. So I got that PK. For 375 I got this right here. Have you ever seen these? I actually have one. I have a 40 cal. Double tap, 9 millimeter, right? So when these were first came out, they were hot little sellers. They sold for almost, uh, you know, 600 bucks in MSRP. Oops, I, I mentioned that again. Uh, I used to sell them uh, for 250 I sold a whole bunch for 250 bucks. This is my last one. $200. $200. 9 millimeter. 9 millimeter. We do it on this side. 9 millimeter, $200. And it's a little uh, two-shot. Derringer, right? Uh, fun and heck to shoot. You got two here, two here. Uh, you got four, right? Nine mil. Now listen, I have sell a lot of these. I recommend a lot of these. This is the uh, Springfield. Wait, let me make sure I make a, get the right one. Six forty two, or not Springfield. Smith and Wesson, six forty two, right? I love a revolver, right? Here's a nice thing. Can you see this? Wait, let me make, make sure I do this right. Boop, 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 boop. Right? It's got a laser. Now I typically sell this. Right for let's see, uh, 420 bucks. I'm still going to sell it for 240 bucks, but typically the 420 does not include boop boop the laser, right? So I'm selling it for 420 with the laser, right? Now listen, it's got a peaking handle. I got a black handle as well. You can have both. I don't care, right? His and hers. Uh, what do they say? What do they say? Uh, 420, right? Uh, okay, listen, now this is a big seller. It's always been a big seller. I actually got a bodyguard in stock as well. So I typically sell them for $356. I have one in stock right now. The second, $325. So like this is like $30 bucks up, 10% off, man. That's a good deal. So listen, I also have, and I don't carry a lot of these, Glock 23. So this is a 40 cal. This is a manly, manly weapon, right? I actually have it. So typically I sell it. For about five eighteen, I have this one right here in stock four seventy five. So come on by and get this. No, I'm not selling used cars or anything else, right? I'm selling firearms, right? So uh, now this one, uh, this is a Sky S C C Y. I always call it Scuzzy for whatever reason, uh, but it's a Sky. I typically uh, sell it on my site for two fifty, and this is a nine mil. I'm going to sell this for two hundred dollars, right? Two hundred bucks, right there, right? Okay, so that's just a handgun. I just got six handguns. I want them out, right? Because I don't like having them. It makes me nervous, right? It draws the criminal element. No, no, no. Not Hillary Clinton. Criminal element. Like real criminals, right? Who aren't protected by whatever statute. Okay, so here's the deal. So here's what I got. Wait, let me turn my page. Can I turn my page? Uh, I got an AR-15. Why is it not on my shield? Oh, there it is. So I typically sell this as an Oracle, 
right? D, uh, DPMS, Oracle, typically sell this for, it's an AR-15, right? It's a scary weapon, you know, the assault rifle, right? So anyway, I typically sell for a 520. I have this one here for, wait, wait, 500 bucks. AR-15, 500 bucks right here. Okay, listen. Now listen, I have this right here. This is a youth rifle, right? So this one, let me sure I get this right. It's a uh, Savage Rascal Bolt Action 22, right? So this is meant to be a youth rifle. It's not a toy. Firearms are never toys, right? But it's a youth rifle. So if you have somebody young that you want to get into the sport of shooting, right? It's a small little bolt action, and you can see how sort of small it is. It's perfect size uh, for somebody you're introducing into firearms. And listen, every kid should should be trained in firearms safety, right? If, if, even if they never touch one, right? Okay, and then I have, so I got this other little firearm. I actually sort of like this. This right here, it's a single shot. Oops, I did it wrong. I did it wrong. Sorry. Uh, it's actually a single shot. It's a Rossi single shot break action, right? Just single shot. Just got one, right? And this is a 20 gauge. Now, this is the insanity. I normally sell this for $145. I'm selling this for $100. One, $100, right? Uh, so if you want that, come by. Now, listen, I have as well. I actually have three shotguns, so let's go over this. So this is my favorite little self-defense weapon for home, and it's the pistol grip, pump action, kick butt shotgun. Now I have three of them. I got a 12 gauge, I got a 20 gauge, and I got a 410, right? So the 12 gauge is, uh, you know, it's got some kick, right? But I have one in stock. So the 12 gauge, uh, wait, let me see, don't go away, 12 gauge. Um, I have, it's actually the Maverick, right? So the Maverick is made by Mossberg, but I have the 12 gauge. I typically sell for 253 because it's a Maverick. I'm selling it for 225, right? And then I have a 410. So the 410 is a real small shot. And I tell you, I like those. They just don't have nearly as much kick. And especially for women uh, who are smaller, no. Uh, but, but women who are small in stature, right? Uh, so they can have a pump action 410. You get some self-defense ammo. Trust me, the guy's going to go away quickly, right? And so I have that one. Wait, let me see. The 410. The 410. I'm so, so I normally sell for 377. I'm selling it for 325. That's like 50 bucks off. That is insane. Okay, now listen, I have this one here. I want to tell you about this one. Right? So this one is a quote unquote a return. Right? So a guy got it and what happened was is there was actually some minor, minor discoloration on the barrel here, right? And there was a scratch inside the receiver. You can't see it? No. You see it in there? It was a little scratch guy. I didn't like it. Hey, I'll take it back. I don't care. Right? Uh, and so this one here, let's see. This, and this is a Mossberg. So I normally sell it for three ninety two, dollars But because it's got a little bit of discoloration and a little scratch here, I'm actually selling it for $300. That's $92. What I normally sell it for. And my prices are just insane low. Right? So the bottom line is I've got six handguns, I got six long arms, AR-15s, uh, I got AR-15s for you know 500 of the Oracle, I got pump action shotguns for as low as $300, right? And then I got 325 for the 410, I've got um, 225 for the 12 gauge Maverick, all pistol grips, 100 bucks for the Rossi single shot break action. I got uh, 125 for that little youth rifle, the 22. And then for his handguns, I got the Smith & Wesson, uh, the Bodyguard, which is a big seller, right? I'm selling for 325. Uh, the Smith & Wesson, I'm selling for 420 with the laser, right? Got it with the laser. Glock 23, which is insane price, 475. I got that Walther, the pink one, uh, 375. Uh, double tap. 200, the SCCY, the Sky or the SCSI uh, for 200 as well, right? And so listen, I just want them gone. I want to sell them today, no, as much as some of you would like. I'm not going out of business if I'm doing anything, right? I actually just want to get rid of them. I'm uncomfortable uh, with as many lunatics as we have. We, got many, we, got, we have an MS-13 gang member, member arrested in Lovettsville. They allowed them in the FBI, did a big roundup of the MS-13 people. Uh, and one of them, or one or two, actually lived, my understanding, in Lovettsville. He wrapped up a whole bunch of them, right? I don't want them in my store. I want them in your hands, right? So listen, come up. I got a scratch right here. 
Uh, I want you to come up to my store. Now, don't come up to my store. I want you to get online. It's www Minute Man Arms for you. That's Minute Man Arms number four, the letter U dot com. And I want you to go on the left hand side. In store, in stock, you're going to go firearms, and there's 12 firearms I want sold today, right? Uh, so listen, as always, uh, you know, we have a God-given natural right of self-defense, and we have a constitutionally protected right to keep and bear arms, and it says very clearly that that shall not be in friends, right? And it talks about the people, people. Uh, right to keep and bear arms shall not be infringed. That term shall not be infringed is used in no other amendment. Now, religion, not press, not uh, assembly, uh, you know, any of these other things, right? It's for the Second Amendment. Why? Because the Second Amendment is what protects our nation from the tyranny of an overreaching government, right? And don't think for a second that we can have that here. We are slowly, you know, going down that road of of a bigger and bigger government that has more and more control over your daily lives, right? Uh, that's what the Second Amendment is meant to help uh, defend against, right? So God bless. Go to my website. Take care. This is Friday, Black Friday. It's not a Black Friday sale, right? It's just a sale. Right? God bless. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.